What's up guys, welcome to BT News. My name is Chance Cadell and on the show, we'll be informing you of all the amazing things happening here at Butler Tech. We have some awesome segments featuring students and staff members around campus that we'll be sharing with you today, as well as a special guest interview with our field reporter. Let's get started with the news. Halloween is this Sunday. Please be safe if you're out trick-or-treating, but most importantly, make sure that you are having fun and enjoying the holiday. Your books are finally able to be ordered. Please order it by May 13th, 2022 if you want to own a yearbook for yourself. Ask Ms. Stitzel for more information. Now let's get to class for classroom challenges. Classroom challenges! Hi, welcome to Classroom Challenges, uh, where today I'm your host, Charlie Alejandro, and we'll be having our contestants be decorating these here pumpkins with anything on this table. So, Ms. Cooper, how do you feel about your uh, decorating skills for pumpkins? Um, I just found out about it, so we'll see. I'm going to have to be as creative as I can. Well, I hope you do great. Thank you. Of course. So, Ms. Stitzel, how do you feel uh, your decorating skills are when it comes to uh, pumpkins? I feel pretty good. Pretty good? All right. Glad to hear it. Three, two, one. All right, Coop, here we go. Oh gosh, let me see this. And you can probably gather what I'm doing. <laughs> it's so hard to get in there. I know, this is not easy. <laughs> I need a darker one. <laughs> Mine is so bad. <laughs> it didn't quite work, but oh my ish. Ah, oh, it came out. There it goes. Feeling? <laughs> Can you guess who mine is? Any guesses? Um, I see that it's a scary pig, but is it from a movie? It's not a scary pig. <laughs> <laughs> scary pig. Oh, that's pretty good what you'd say what it is. <laughs> no, it's, I didn't even think it was Shrek. You know, I had to work with what I had here. So, Scooper, how do you feel about your pumpkin now it's all done? I mean, I think she looks really scary. Mm, yeah. I think I think she I think it's a she, especially yeah. with the pink. I think she looks scary. Rather frightening. Yes. yes. So, Ms. Stitzel, how do you feel about your pumpkin now it's all done? Well, I'm a little disappointed. I won't lie. It looks a little less Yoda and a little more scary pig. Yeah. I thought it was Frankenstein, but it looks awesome. <laughs> 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 I think it looks really fun. <laughs> We'd like to thank our wonderful guests, Ms. Cooper and Ms. Stitzel, for coming on the show today. And we'll see you all next week on Classroom Challenges. Classroom Challenges! <laughs>are you ready for all campuses masquerade fall ball the ball will be held at the school of the arts event center from 7 p.m to 10 p.m on october 30th tickets will be on sale at 20 dollars each at your lunches october 18th through the 28th masquerade style masks are encouraged and the colors are blue orange and silver it will be a night to remember have you been wanting to buy butler tech merch well you're just in luck the spirit shop will be having their grand opening on november 3rd Presentations are only two weeks away. This is this time to start preparing. If you need any help, please contact your counselor or lab instructor. Now let's see who can talk with the tunes. Hi, today on Tune Talk, Halloween edition, we're gonna see people who can guess the Halloween song. Happy Halloween, fellas. Hello, we are here with... Sergeant G. And we are gonna see if you can guess the Halloween song, okay? All right, let's hear it. Sweet, play it Zane. Lab late one night when my eyes are 
Skittles. Monster Mash. That is correct. Can you say that one more time? Monster Mash. That is cor I'm on a sugar. correct. Um, I know you don't eat sugar. We had some Skittles. Would you like a handshake instead? Oh, dude, we do handshakes all day, man. What you got up here? <laughs> like, what is this? You're a monkey, aren't you? I, aren't monkeys yeah. supposed to be like, you should have given me your foot. Hi, we are here with... Darius. And we are going to see if you can guess the Halloween song, okay? All right. Play it, Zane. Is that that uh, Ghostbusters? That is correct. Uh, as a surprise, you can dig for gold if you would like. Thank you very much. Hi, we are here with... Caden Wallace. And we are going to see if you can guess the Halloween song, okay? Sounds good to me. Play it, Zane. Do you know the song? Is it Nightmare Before Christmas? Yes, but do you know the song name? This is Halloween? That is correct. Now, if you went for a prize, you can take this, because you're looking like some real eye candy. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. The Bully Tech leadership team is leaning into facilitating student voice, relationships with instructors, and engagement in the classroom. Now it's time to check in with our field reporter, Jasmine. Welcome to the Butler Tech News Field Report. My name is Jasmine Hudson, and today we have here Ms. Robertson, talking a little bit about showcases. When are the showcases? Our showcases this year, our internal showcases first semester are November 15th through the 18th. And what is the showcases? What are we doing? Showcases are an opportunity for kids to talk about their learning and their passions and how those two things come together here at Butler Tech. How do we start preparing for that? I think that you guys are lucky because we've already spent a lot of time, at least here on the DRL campus, uh, with your lab advisor, your academic lab partner, and your classmates getting your showcases ready. But I think an important thing for students to do is to share their showcases with one another. Ask like, hey, what are you talking about? Can I share with you what I'm talking about? All of that, it's great practice. All right, and are you ready and excited to see what the students have came up with? Yes, I'm so excited. Two years ago, um, I was brand new at Butler Tech, and it was the first year we did showcases. And I remember just being so totally and completely blown away by the skills and talents and passion and capabilities that our kids have. I expect now, two years later, it's going to be that much better. So I can't wait. We can now check in with the labs at Bullet Tech with Day in the Lab. What's up, Butler Tech? Welcome back to our seventh episode. And for today's episode, we are going to be doing a Halloween special with Cosmo. Let's go. What do you teach your juniors and your seniors in this program? Okay, so your junior year, they're learning about all things hair, primarily. Hair, right. And so they're going to learn the basics of hair, a little bit of hair coloring, but that's mm -hmm. going to be reserved for senior year for the most part. Right. We're going to learn to wrap perms. Mm -hmm. We're going to learn to do roller sets. We're going to learn to do foil highlighting, color applications. Mm -hmm. We're going to learn about relaxers, how to do that. Um, how, all things hair, pretty all much. Things what has been some of your favorite things that you've done in this program, either last year or this year? Um, probably getting to dye my mannequins crazy colors. I've done green, I've done blue, green, and yellow on one mannequin. Mm -hmm. All types of colors. And I get to experiment with my own. Why would you recommend this program? Because it's like you get to meet new people, get to experience different things, get to learn different things. Mm -hmm. And you can get your cosmetology license by the time you graduate. Cool, cool. What has been some of your favorite things you learned in this program, either last year or this year? Oh, this year I learned how to cut properly, like mm -hmm. do 180s, layers, and all of that. I did an all over color on people. Sounds cool. Sounds cool. Perms. Yeah, yeah. What do you plan on doing after high school? Um, I plan on going to esthetician classes and other hair classes that uh, brought in my variety of cosmetology. Mm -hmm. um, and I'll also get my cosmetology license after I graduate, so I can instantly start working in a salon. Then, for senior year, we reserve some things that we keep out to keep as exciting for senior year. Yeah. So they will be learning nails, mm. manicuring, okay. pedicuring, facial waxing, facials, 
all kinds of things like that. We bring in some guest yeah. people to teach some eyelash extensions. Yeah. We will bring in some people to teach acrylic nails. So lots of exciting things that we reserve for senior mm. privilege, right? Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> All right, what's up? Uh, we are currently at the part of a challenge. We have Diamond here. She's going to explain what the challenge for today's episode is. So we're going to do... How disappointing. We are at the end of our episode. Thanks for joining us, students. If you want to see more episodes of BT News or more work done by the digital media students, check out our YouTube channel at Buller Tech Media. That's all for the news today. I'm Antoine. See you next time.